Hey everybody, Bob Daly with OptimizeYourGolfGame.com. I uh, wanted to talk today a little bit about uh, acceleration uh, and distance control. Um, and what, what do the two have to do with each other? Um, obviously, we do accelerate uh, when we swing with a driver. When we swing with an iron, anything full swing, there's always acceleration through the ball, no matter what, because it's a full swing. Right? We're swinging with all our might or all our guts to get club head through the ball. So there's always acceleration. Um, big problem, and we hear it often, people struggle with you know, distance control. I don't know how far to, or how hard to swing uh, when I'm chipping, uh, pitching, and certainly putting when we're on the green. Um, so a big thing to pay attention to is acceleration. No matter what, to be consistent and to make solid contact, we need acceleration. So certainly, like I said, full swing, clubs accelerating all the time. Uh, when we're chipping, pitching, we need acceleration through the ball. We have to have that through the ball. So if it's, and it, we hear the term pace a lot, just control the pace. But as long as you're accelerating through that point of impact, through the ball, maintain that. And by that, not stopping here, right? How often do we chip and stop here? Well, you're decelerating, right? If you're stopping here in a full swing, you're decelerating through impact. So we want to accelerate through. So when we're putting, right, what does that mean, right? Obviously, we're going to accelerate when we have a putt that is, you know, a 50 foot putt across the green, right? We're trying to smash that. No different than the, the nine iron into the green we just hit. Um, so we're going to accelerate through the ball, but we get. We get an eight-footer, uh, a four-footer, and certainly a two-footer, right? These little tap-in putts um, or short putts, and we can't, I can't get it to the hole. I hit it four feet past, I'm inconsistent. How do we get around that, right? We wanna control acceleration or pace, or, or control pace, but we need to accelerate the club head through the ball no matter what the distance. If it's a, a short little putt to the end of the sticks here, right, as long as I get through, I'm okay, I'm just controlling the pace through the ball or the speed. Maintain that through the ball, right? Get through it and get to the to the hole, so to speak. If it's a further putt, if it's an eight footer, same thing, right? I'm just gonna control my pace, right? A little bit further, maybe a little bit more, a little, little quicker. Okay, get through it, okay? And I'll talk a little bit more a little later on on some theories around short game uh, and putting different principles um, and theories that can apply to help everyone with that stuff um, and, and really compart compartmentalize the uh, uh, different shots that we need to hit. But understand that acceleration needs to happen through every putt, be it a two footer, a 20 footer, and it's just getting the ball through, okay? With the stroke, take a backswing, and I like to think my backswing equals the length of my backswing equals the length of my forward swing. So especially on those short putts, if it's a short putt, I'm bringing it back maybe a foot, 10 inches. I want to follow through minimum that. Okay. Same thing if I'm chipping or pitching these short shots, I don't want a little stabby, you know, punch. I want to get through it to make sure that I accelerate through the grass. Okay. Thank you everybody. Talk to you soon.